Did you know that Power Rangers recently closed an 11 euro cliffhanger? I'm talking about the ending of Power Rangers RPM, released in 2009, which was actually supposed to be the last season of Power Rangers ever. In it, the evil computer virus Vendrix destroyed almost the entire world, with the only ones left being in the domed city of Korn. And in the last episode, the RPM Rangers managed to defeat him, or so they thought, because the last scene actually implied Vendrix having survived in the morpher of the Red Ranger. This was done as the writers knew this would be the last season of the show, and wanted to end the show on a cliffhanger in hopes of maybe one day returning to it. But just one year later, Disney, who owned the franchise back then, sold the rights back to its original owner, Heim Saban, who then revamped the show and made Power Rangers Samurai. And since the team making the show was a different one, the cliffhanger from Power Rangers RPM was quickly forgotten. Until Power Rangers Beast Morphers came along in 2019 and featured an evil computer virus named Evox as its main villain. Fans instantly connected him to Vendrix, but it seemed more like a fanfiction idea than something they would actually do in the show. But lo and behold, in the penultimate episode of Power Rangers Beast Morphers, Evox finally reveals his origin. You're starting to put it together. A cell shift morpher that could mean only one thing. I was Vengeance! And yes, they even used the same voice actor from back in the day, who used an anagram in the credits of Power Rangers Beast Morphers for the entirety of his work as Evox to hide the big plot twist. Follow for more Power Rangers facts and lore.